everyone. Today, me and my van crew are about to hike to a hot spring here in Oregon. It's finally feeling chilly outside. Getting some major fall vibes right now, which I'm pretty freaking excited about, because you know me. I love me some fall, I love me some spooky vibes. And these beautiful, lush trees are just making me so happy right now. We've been in the desert for weeks, and it's nice to be around some green, lush foliage. And this hot spring looks pretty freaking beautiful too. It's right on a river. And we're all about to pile in my van and carpool down the road to it. So let's freaking do it. Hold his breath and closes his eyes. Let's go, Millie Millie. It's crazy. Never it's crazy. Never it's crazy. It's So pretty. Watching satellites spin the truth. Every single time with Mammoth, there's been a lot of thoughts that she can like. Uh, <laughs> I guess I'll take part in this. It feels pretty nice, honestly. It's nature's scrub. <laughs> This week, I'm excited to announce that I am working with Omaze again to offer you all a chance to win a Mercedes Sprinter van with $80,000 worth of renovations. This van has everything you need to get you outside on the road adventuring so you can go to really cool places like this one. And outside of the beautiful interior renovations of this van, my favorite part about Mercedes Sprinter vans is the fact that they have four wheel drive. And having four wheel drive on your van opens up so much more opportunities for cooler campsites and even going off road, which is something I can't do in my current van because it's only two wheel drive. And when you enter for a chance to win this awesome van, you'll also be supporting a really great cause, the J. Watt Foundation. This foundation is on a mission to encourage middle school age children to dream big by providing them with after school activities in the community so they can become involved in athletics. And by entering the sweepstakes, your generosity will go to help these kids expand their horizons and help them learn lessons that'll live with them for the rest of their life. So for your chance to win a Mercedes Sprinter van while also supporting a really great cause, you can go to omaze.com slash the fine print or tap the link in the description of this video and enter now. Well, I'm finally on the Oregon coast, which is the farthest I've ever been from home. And it's pretty freaking awesome. Right now, I am at a beach. As you can tell, it's like super foggy, so you can't really see much of anything right now. And I'm here with friends, which is different for me. <laughs> I typically travel alone, but lately, these past few weeks, um, I've been traveling with people that I met at Descend on Ben, which if you haven't seen my video about Descend on Ben, you should go watch it. It's a really, really great video. The link for it will be in the description of the video, so go check it out if you haven't seen that. But after that event was over, a big group of us decided to stick around and travel together. And it's just been so nice to be traveling with other people for once. Because for the past three something years of my life living in a van, 
I've been traveling alone for the most part. And while being alone is great, it gets to you sometimes. <laughs> and these past few weeks of traveling with my new friends has made me realize how much I missed a sense of community in my life, a stable community. Because, yeah, I meet a lot of people on the road, you know, traveling in a van, but I'm constantly saying goodbye to these people because I'm never in a place long enough to make or maintain relationships with people. And that gets really hard for me because goodbye suck. <laughs> and finally being surrounded by a group of people that are able to travel with me has just been so nice to have a stable community in my life. <laughs> I didn't realize how much I missed it, but here we are. Yay. I got transport. All right. Yes. Is everyone ready? Uh, did you get no? our first? Can we all like do some sort Welcome of intro thing? Like, yeah. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Ready? Three, two. Hot Ones! Hi, everyone, and welcome to Van Life Hot Ones, where we <laughs> Where you get to watch all your favorite van lifers throw up in about 60 minutes. Woo! There you go, there you go. Yeah. We're about to eat some spicy vegan friendly tendies while we maybe ask each other questions. I don't know. We brought some right? Possibly, yeah. Possibly. Okay, so this is level one here. Chopsticks. Cheers. Cheers. Yay. The whole thing. Oh, not yeah, that's not that hot is at all. So spicy. What is how, wrong with how you? How sauce? Hot like sauce. Just... This is level six. This is de bomb, de bomb. which is a pretty hot Hang sauce. On. I'm already oh, dying here, but um, I gotta put some. We're gonna go for on. it. I'm afraid oh, to touch. The bomb. Oh, oh, I'm scared. Oh I feel no. Like this is gonna be I know this one's gonna hurt. I'm ready for it Blood. though. <laughs> I didn't chew oh, it. I didn't chew it. Oh, All right, yeah. so here we are at the very end of the challenge. We are at the last dab. The hottest. <laughs> <laughs> Got All right, let's do it, boys and girls. Let's do it. Woo! Stop. Stop. I swallowed it whole. I didn't even chew. I swallowed it whole. I didn't even chew. Oh my god. I need to swallow it. Oh! Like it's this. in the back of the throat. It's back there. Yeah. Like in the soft That's too much. Breathe. We put too much on the top. <laughs> oh my I'm god. I'm sweating. Hold up. I need bread. This is too much. <laughs> oh, damn. It just hit me. <laughs> I'm literally, tears are coming out of my eyes. Talking makes it feel worse. Nigga, so. can you please get more milk? I need talking makes it feel worse. Here we go. <laughs> um. We've all connected and bonded over these spicy ass. Oh! <laughs> We're bonding together. We're I'm dying, dude. We're bonding together. And all that just to say that lately I've just had this overwhelming sense of comfort and calmness in my life. And I think that's because I finally don't really feel that alone anymore. One of my biggest struggles of living in a van is that like I feel so disconnected from the world and finally with a consistent group of people to travel with, yeah, we're a little bit of the outcasts in society, but we're outcasts together <laughs> and it's so nice. And it's been great because we're all content creators and I'll leave a link to everyone that I'm traveling with in the description of this video so you guys can watch their content as well. But. We've all just been waking up, doing our work, whether it's editing videos, sending out emails, whatever, and then going on an adventure together. And we really are just living the life right now. And it just feels so good to finally be sharing this experience with other people that understand it. I don't know, I'm rambling at this point, but I just wanted to document my feelings right now because I am incredibly thankful 